guys, Keith here with the Bobcat guy. And uh, I want to ask you plow guys what you would do in this scenario. I had some product shipped in from uh, a company out of Calgary and they kind of screwed up the order, uh, which is understandable. It's partly my fault. I read the email and said, yeah, go ahead. But they had the wrong part numbers in and shipped me stuff for a different plow. But I ordered cutting edges and a wing kit for my plow. So, so I'll show you here. This is a wing kit, uh, but it's not for my plow. It's for Extreme V, and I ordered for Extreme V2. Partly my fault, not a problem. That's not where I've got concern. I ordered a set of cutting edges. Now, for you plow guys, that's the cutting edge at the bottom. You guys all know that, people that don't plow. That's the small steel. I'm going to show you here and switch the camera around. I ordered this, just the blade for the cutting edge, right? And it comes all the way around and there's two sides. This is what I got. I got a crate. Um, they sent me a whole plow. This is a Western plow, which is interchangeable parts. So for you guys that don't know, the Western MVP3 is identical to, besides color, it's identical construction to the Extreme V2 from Fisher. And this is just Western brand. So they actually sent me a whole plow, and yes, it comes with a cutting edge. Um, I phoned the company, and uh, I said, what's, what's going on? I said, I couldn't understand why the shipping was so much. I said, you sent me a whole plow. And she goes, well, what do you want me to do about it? And I says, order me the right parts. Well, what do you want to do with this parcel? You want to keep it? And of course, I'm telling you, I paid 500 bucks for this crate, which she told me the cutting edges um, went up. I used to pay about 380 last year. They were $500. So I got this whole crate for 500 bucks and they're not sure if they want it back. What would you guys do? Let me know in the comments and uh, I'll get this posted. It's kind of funny, I don't understand uh, businesses nowadays. Um, so I had to physically go in to Fisher, write down all the part numbers that I need, give them to her, so hopefully they get them straight this time. Um, you know, we're talking $1,300 plus a hundred and some dollars to ship it down from Calgary. Um, and nothing is right. I could take the cutting edges off of this and put them on my plow. They'll work fine. I just didn't need a whole new plow. What do you do? Okay, leave them out in the comments. Uh, tell me what you guys would do that plow. Um, they're not interested. Doesn't sound like they're interested in getting it back. Uh, you know, so I might keep it and uh, build a new plow, I guess. Maybe I need to buy another truck. Who knows? Thanks for coming out. Thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please do.